A South Suburban family is looking for a man they call an angel. As CBS 2's My Martinez reports, the family says he saved the life of this little boy. Ah. Two-year-old Noah's voice is music to his mom's ears. It's amazing that he's even still here. That's because of a close call around 7 o'clock Tuesday night when Graham took Noah and his big sister Madeline to this Alsip subway on Cicero. The kids were sharing Doritos when Noah started choking on one. He just started turning real pale and then he was like blue. Surveillance video shows nine-year-old Madeline running to get help. She went running to the counter to where that man was and said that my brother is in trouble. And he just came running back and he unbuckled that stroller and took my son right out. Graham says the man put Noah over his knee and started slapping him on the back. The chips came out and everything else came out with it. And he, the lady was saying that he was breathing, he was crying, that he's okay. Graham was so shaken up by what happened, she rushed Noah into the bathroom to clean him up. But when she came back into the subway, the man who had saved him was gone. Wanting to thank him properly and offer to pay for his dry cleaning, Graham turned to Facebook to try to find the man. Her post has been shared thousands of times. What do you remember about him? Um, he was tall, good looking, spiky hair, very, very well dressed. Graham hopes someone will recognize the man from the video so he'll come forward. But if he doesn't, she has this message for him. Thank you so much for saving my son. And that if you didn't step in, that it would have turned really bad because there was nobody there to help. My Martinez, CBS 2 News. My thank you. Noah's little sister says the man was driving a light blue or gray car. As for Graham, she wants to learn CPR so she can help her son or any child if she ever finds herself in a similar situation.